Let's get this thumbnail. Okay, I think that's enough. Alright y'all, welcome to the vlog. Welcome to the haul. So we are going to be doing a back to school slash fall collective haul. These are just some pieces that I've been picking up and collecting over the past like, two months. Mm, that's a stretch, like a month and a half. But yeah, let's just get into it. Yeah, so the first thing I'm gonna start with are shoes. I only have two. I'd like to say that this is an accomplishment for me because if you guys could see all the shoes I have in my closet, First, we have the Yeezy Foam Runners in the um, colorway Onyx. I'm not gonna lie, when I first saw these shoes, I was like, these are ugly. But when I saw that they came out in the black colorway, aka the Onyx, I was like, ooh. That might be something that I like. I entered for them on Yeezy Day and ended up winning them. I absolutely love the way that they look. Um, it's just like super, something super simple. Like you can put on like a nice good hoodie, good pair of jeans, throw those on real quick and simple fit. Yeah, and they're comfortable. Um, they're comfortable like Crocs to me at least. One thing I will say though is that you have to wear them with socks. In my case, um, first time I wore them, I didn't wear socks with them because it's pretty common and I literally got blisters on each ankle um, and they were so painful it was just not a good time so since that time or since that first wear I've been wearing them with socks ever since and I haven't had that problem again um, so my only thing would be just wearing them with socks. Also I apologize if I'm looking to the right instead of straight forward um, I just got a new camera and uh, the viewfinders to the right, to my right at least. Next thing I got were um, a pair of Dunks. These are the Dunk Lows. They come from the Next Nature collection and I believe this is light ochre brown, but I will correct that um, if that's not right. These are just a nice oatmeal color. I'm not gonna touch the bottom, it's kind of crazy. Um, but yeah, it's kind of like a cracked leather. Not a cracked, but like a textured leather rather than just plain leather. These, super cute. A great neutral sneaker to have in your collection. I'm personally a very big fan of Dunks. I wear my Panda Lows to like, I ran those into the ground. Um, so when I hit on these, I was super excited to get them because I knew that I was also going to wear these a lot because of, you know, the color I am more careful with wearing these but yeah overall love my dunks getting a second pair really just made me realize how much i love them and that i want to continue to get them okay so told y'all only had two pairs of shoes nice and simple now we're gonna get into the clothes the first store that i'm going to start with is uniqlo i just got two shirts from there and they are the same shirts it is one of their basic tees um so the first one i got is in this gray green color um it looks extremely green on camera right now but when i saw it in person the first time it was really gray my boyfriend pointed out that it looked a little green i was like no nah, like i really can't see what you're talking about oh, baby we're right so i got that in that color and then i also got it in this nice orange shade I've thought about cropping them, but I just don't think they'd look good with a raw hem. And your girl doesn't know how to stitch. Your girl doesn't know how to sew. Um, so I'm probably just gonna leave them full length, but definitely good for layering, good for, you know, if you just want to tuck the shirt into a pair of jeans, put a cardigan over it, whatever the case may be. Um, but definitely a good, good basic shirt that, you know, you could style it up or you could just dress it down, you could wear it to work, you could wear it casually. Definitely a very good versatile top. Next store that I'm going to show is going to be Zara. Um, two things from there. First, I got this pink, baby pink, kind of like baby tee. It's only $10, $10. I also have this in white 
and like a, a sage green color um, but i got those during the summer so i didn't really want to include those but if you follow me on my tiktok you would have seen the video when i posted it over the summer so be sure to go follow me on tiktok so you can stay up to date with all the videos all the clothing hauls everything that i post so just a nice cute simple shirt um it's not thick but it's definitely not like shein material it's not thin um just a nice another good shirt for layering but cropped and then the next thing i got are these jeans they are slim and also uh split hem um they're high rise and also full length so this is what they look like all the way down and then at the end they're just regular straight jeans but with a little bit of that split hem i like that the split hem isn't anything too crazy it's something that's super subtle i feel like it's definitely another pair of jeans that are super versatile i don't have a pair of gray jeans so when i saw these and they were on sale um i picked them up zara jeans are definitely hit or miss especially if you are on the curvier side but i definitely looked out by getting these they fit good in the waist the hips all of that um there isn't really that much stretch which i know when it comes to brands like zara that's just a sacrifice that you have to make but it is okay because it paid off because the jeans look nice they fit nice they were on sale it was a win across the board the next place i'm going to show is parade first thing i got from there is this everyday um new cotton tee now you may be looking like oh what's that pattern bees they're bees I personally think it's adorable this was definitely out of my comfort zone this isn't usually a pattern that i would go for but when i saw it i was like i need to be stepping out of my comfort zone and i really need to be building up my closet but yeah it's just this is i wouldn't say completely full length like the shirts from uniqlo but it definitely is like falls right below the belly button so personally it's a perfect length to me it's super lightweight super stretchy it's it's actually kind of weird it's super stretchy but also really forms to your body don't ask me the science behind that because i don't know i really don't know couldn't explain it if my life depended on it and then the second thing that i got from parade is from their new lush rib collection it's just this tan neutral colored long sleeve um i did order this a size too big um so i definitely wouldn't wear this by itself just because when it is with it being a size too big it looks a little bit too baggy and not form fitted like it's supposed to i definitely would use this as a layering piece um or just for in the winter when it's super cold you gotta throw on another like solid layer underneath a hoodie a jacket a crew neck something like that length is i'd say a little bit more cropped than the bumblebee tee that i just previously showed you guys next door i'm gonna show is aritzia i got three things from there all the same item just in different colors and it is the babaton um sculpting bodysuits like the regular t-shirt neckline bodysuit um these are not super expensive but they're definitely a pretty penny it's an investment but the material like you can just tell you're gonna get not only lots of wear out of this but it's going to look so good every time and it's really going to hold up over time as well um it's a very buttery texture um that's thin on the sleeves um but not in the way of being cheap but in the way of being breathable and then on the body it's double layered and much thicker um so it provides that smoothing effect while also keeping everything in um and just making everything look nice and clean and uniform so this is the first color that i got it in i don't know the exact name off the top of my head but i'll definitely put it on the screen but it's this nice taupe brown color the next color that i got it in was this baby pink color i've really been feeling pink i really don't know why um it's just really been speaking to me i think i just like the way it looks on my skin tone and then lastly i got it in another neutral color that's like a stone gray um but yeah just another essential basic next store i'm going to show you is going to be express first thing i got from express is this bodysuit it is just a regular um high neck bodysuit white 
um definitely is a little see-through so i wish that i got a different color um and again using this as a base layer for putting it over a cardigan jacket things like that it's gonna end up being fine super lightweight material super nice it does run a little big though so i would be wary of that Okay, and the next thing I got from Express were these wide leg high rise black jeans. These also don't stretch, but again, it's just another sacrifice you have to make when shopping in mainstream stores um, that I've kind of just come to accept. But surprisingly, they fit pretty well, a little tight in the thigh area, but otherwise fit pretty uniform. It's the perfect length um, for high rise. Um, I, one of my pet peeves is getting high rise pants and literally having the pant come up to like my rib cage. I just, uh, my torso isn't that long. There is just unnecessary. <laughs> yeah, these pants, they're just the perfect length. They're not too long where they're like dragging on the floor with every step I take, but they're not obviously so short where I felt like I had to get a, um, exchange them for a long. Um, yeah, those are the pants I got from Express. And another store was American Eagle. I got two things from there. The 90 straight pant, but they're basically cargoes. Like, I've literally been searching, like, that's not even an exaggeration, years for cargoes that fit me. Whether the issue would be they don't stretch, um, the hip to waist ratio, they're too short, um, like lengthwise. It was just always a problem. But with American Eagle, they came through. So I just got them in two colors. The first shade I got them in was this cream color. And then I also got them in an olive green, but I won't be trying those on. Um, one thing I love is the stretchy waistband in the front. Um, that really does make a difference. And then also, they're stretchy too. Okay, yeah, I've just heard such good things about them. And then when I got them in and I put them on, yeah, I understood the hype. Um, I will be getting more pairs because... They have a few other shades. They have a darker khaki. They have a gray, um, like a maroon shade. They have navy blue. Like, I feel like they're Pokemon. I got, I got to get them all. I got to get them all. No day. And the last store that I went to was Abercrombie and Fitch. I can't try these on because I'm exchanging these, but just for a different length. Same exact style. Um, and color and wash. So I'm gonna insert a picture from the app just so you guys can get an idea. Um, but they are the 90 straight ultra high rise curve love jeans. Um, I already have a pair of these, um, but just with two rips in the knees and they fit absolutely perfectly. And I got those in the regular length. So I decided while I really like that length, I want them just like a tiny, just a tiny bit longer. I just wanted them and then I order these, same waist length as the ones that fit perfect, and I get these, and they're doing the thing where my jeans come up to my rib cage, and then they're dragging on the floor, and then there's a giant gap in the waist area, but then they fit the thighs, and I was like, this is giving very much, like, not the jeans I already have. Like, I'm just confused, mind boggled. I was, I literally was just so confused when I tried them on. And ugh, the closest Abercrombie is not even close for real. It's not even close for real. So I went online and it turns out I can do online exchanges. Mm -hmm. So that's exactly what I'm gonna do because I really, really like, I'm so in love with the first pair I have with the two ribs in the knees. Um, I really wear them to death. Um, and I'm like, okay, this is getting out of hand. Like you need another pair. You need a pair without rips in them. And you overall just need another pair because how many times are you gonna wear these damn jeans? That is my, my fall slash back to school clothing haul. I'm really excited to get more content out, especially now that I have my new camera and be able to film quality content that I would like for you guys to see. I know I kept saying it, still not out but i swear i swear the maintenance vlog is coming the maintenance vlog is coming 
back to school maintenance vlog is coming and on its way but yeah stay tuned school is picking up but so is the fire under me to get content out and really um go after go after this passion you know what i mean like life is just too short to not do things that you enjoy and to find what you enjoy and do what makes you happy it's a lot of the time easier said than done and there's gonna be days where like, doing anything but sleeping laying around and just like basic activities anything outside of that is just not going to be doable and those days are completely okay because everyone is human what i've come to realize is that when i have my good days which i'm trying to make every day but it's when i have my good days take an of that live in that happiness and really soak it all in and keep striving to have those happy days be every day so it turns from happy days to happy life thank you for tuning in all the love and the support that you guys have given me um and i will see you in the next video